Hello everyone, welcome. My name is King Gamer here today. I'm a King Gamer figure reviews too. Um, today we're reviewing the NECA Aliens Creature Pack. <laughs> the 30th anniversary. So this pack comes with four face huggers and two chest bursters and two stasis. Um two um two face hugger pods thing. I don't know if they're I don't know what they're called, oh well. So let's take a look at the box. So here we have box here we have aliens creature pack. Side we have this is aliens 30th anniversary. Whoops. Here we have Hudson figure. Here we have Hicks. We have the chest burster, hooker, and there's the bio. If you want to read it, so yeah, and that's basically it for the packaging. So here is whoa, the pack. How did you get over here? So let's take a look at the figure at the two pods right here. Here are the pods. The tops do open, but I don't want to because comes from six metal pens, and they basically when you um take a face hugger, like one of these, if you if you put them in here and fill this up with water, that makes it more movie accurate accurate and just like the movie. So yeah. And basically these do have a s switch right here for the lights. Basically pretty cool. It turns on the light when you fill this up with water because I don't want to because my sister is going to take a shower. So so yeah. Here we have that. Now the face hookers are pretty cool. I like these face hookers. I know they came with other figures. I know they came with the um the alien egg pack, I believe it is. I'm pretty sure oh, I'm pretty sure it is. Pretty sure it is, because these are cool. I got these at Target for about twenty you need twenty dollars at the FYE store. I tried to look for the Genocide Queen even but unfortunately didn't have it, so I got this. So yeah, no for comparison. Here it is next to the Haya Toys face hugger, and as you can see here, it's a lot bigger and a little more. Um, this one, this face hugger, I do like, but it's not really like this color. I mean, it doesn't have really have any detail, and plus the inside, if you look, the inside right here, it's not painted. They just painted it like a solid paint, and then a little bit of pink. I know you punk guys probably can't see this. So yeah, it's just a plain color in the higher toys. If you have any of the higher toys xenomorphs, like the worker, soldier, spitter, or boiler. So yeah, if you take a look at this, NECA painted the inside, which is pretty cool. See? Painted, not painted. Painted, not painted. So yeah, and... Here we have the face hugger. It's nicely detailed. Nice detail of it coming. And on the inside, the legs are made of soft rubber. So, yeah. And these are made of soft rubber, too. The tail is on the beta wire. I have heard that the um, the bendy wire has been popping out. So, you can, you can bend it. So, as you can see here, it's basically on the bendy wire. So, this pack is pretty cool. I do like it a lot, and yeah, however, one of my face huggers was missing a leg. I was looking all over in the box, couldn't find it, so yeah, I think I must have gotten like a bad one, so oh well, what you gonna do? I mean, all these face huggers basically had the same thing now for the chest bursters, if we take a look I've seen people call these like chest busters when it's not buster, it's bursters not buster it's not ghostbusters people yeah uh, focus well focus there we go. so you see here the chest burst is pretty nice nice little bit of sculpted arms in there underneath nice silver teeth in there pretty cool nice little bit of a 
sort of like a face hugger color with red blood on it, just like in the movie. You know, the first and the second, and I think it was no, the third and the third was the runner, so it had a body. But it does have articulation and the bending wire, but be careful because this metal pin on this one popped out when I popped it out of the box. I have no idea. So I basically, you basically just um bend it down, and if yours popped out like this, you want to keep it like that, just hold it, then put some super glue on that and keep it nice. So you want to be careful with that. So yeah, because these don't stand straight and string them out. Watch. Yeah, they don't stand. No, but the only way you can make them stand if you curve their tails like this. So yeah. So yeah. Um. So yeah, for a comparison for the face hooker here, and it's next to the higher toys face hooker again. As you can see here, the high toys line is smaller compared to this pack, so it's not much really to the pack, so I think I'm, it's just a short review, so yeah, I highly recommend this pack if you have, if you have any more, if you don't have like the face huggers or the chest bursters right there, so I highly recommend this pack, it's a very cool pack, um, so yeah, it's very cool, very very cool, very nice, nice detail, nice sculpt, very nice, nice compared to this. Come on, I tell you, no better than that. But anyway, that has been the review of the NECA, NECA 30th, Aliens 30th Anniversary Aliens Creature Pack. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did, like, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for more figures to come.